It's the Taliban mocking America. This photo of Taliban fighters hoisting their flag copies the iconic image of U.S. Marines raising Old Glory on Iwo Jima in World War II. It is one of the most powerful photos in American history and was portrayed in Clint Eastwood's movie, Flags of Our Fathers. Adding further insult, the Taliban are wearing American combat gear head to toe. You have the Taliban mocking our troops in our gear. As the chaos at Kabul airport continues, U.S. troops are doing what they can to offer humanitarian aid, pouring out bottled water for children who've been waiting hours under the baking sun. Look at this soldier cradling a baby in his arms. One youngster got lost in the airport crush. Her desperate loved ones put up this missing poster. Among the lucky ones to get out is an all-girls Afghan robotics team who made headlines in 2017 when they competed in a robotics contest in Washington. Allison Renault, who lives in Oklahoma and met the girls in 2019, helped arrange for their flight. They're safe. That was the number one goal, was to get them to a safe and secure place. Also now on safe ground, CNN reporter Clarissa Ward, who had many tense moments in her fearless reporting from Kabul. They've just told me to stand to the side because I'm a woman. She got an evacuation flight and is now back with her kids and her husband in France, where they live. It was absolutely a wonderful feeling to hug my little boys. She choked up as parents. she told her colleague, Brian Stelter, that her translator had also managed to escape. To he was on the edge of tears and we're trying to comfort him and tell him it's going to be OK. But oh. thank God he got on the plane.